Hi, I'm Kate and today we are looking at the correct setup for the anaesthetic delivery unit when using Surginet anaesthesia. Remember, the ADU setup in the MRI control room is different, so please refer to the MRI setup video for the correct setup sequence. Firstly, turn all the anaesthetic devices and monitors on, ensuring the Philips MX800 is connected to the Philips EC10 module within the module station. Now it's time to connect the Philips MX800 monitors on the anaesthetic machines to the Philips network. This is done by connecting the purple Philips cable from the LAN cable port on the back of the MX800 monitor into the Philips network data point. All Philips network cables and network data points will be labelled with Philips. This is what you should see on the Philips monitor screen if it is successfully connected to the Philips network. To troubleshoot, check your cable connections, the condition of your data cables and reconnect. As you can see, this is the correct location of the Philips network cable. Please note, no cable is in the yellow port the exception being the ADUs in theatre E2 and E3 for perfusion device purposes. Next, you will need to utilise the correct Surginet anaesthesia wow for your designated operating theatre. This will ensure your wow automatically connects to the required anaesthetic devices. All wows will be very clearly labelled as to which theatre location they belong to. If you find yourself in an out of theatre location that does not have a designated WOW, you will need to refer to the Surginet Anesthesia Device Association instructional video for guidance on manually associating anaesthetic devices. To connect your WOW to the Cerner network, plug in the grey data cable from the WOW into the labelled Queensland Health PC data point. Here is an MX450 monitor. These devices are located in induction bays, holding bay and eye bays only. The Philips setup for these remains the same as the MX800 monitors. This completes your demonstration of the correct connection between your anaesthetic delivery unit and Surginet anaesthesia.